seeing as it is Christmas day here at the Happy Homestead house and we're going to have a feast tonight because it's a tradition um, we're going to let our two shepherd dogs have a feast as well we are making very appropriately um, the she yeah. we're making the shepherd's pie so we're gonna have some mints uh, we'll cook the mints, we'll put some peas and beans and veg into it. We'll make doggy gravy, which has reduced salt or something. Um, and then top it up with mashed potato, let it cool, and that's going to be such a feast for you two. They're so excited. They don't even know why, but they're excited. <laughs> shepherd's pie for the two shepherds. So we're not adding any onions or any unnecessary things. It's just going to be mince, veg, doggy gravy and mashed potato on top. And, oh yeah, that sounds delicious! Maybe we'll mix in an egg at some point. Maybe into the mash? Into the mash, I think. Mm, that sounds lovely. It does. A feast for you two. It's what Christmas is about. And I don't think I'll add any butter to the mash. Maybe some milk. Some milk, yeah. Milk and egg? Egg and milk. Sounds lovely. We should probably point out that they've just had a long walk chasing rabbits and Charlie nearly caught one. So that would have made a good addition to the shepherd's pie. But he wasn't successful so uh, it's just gonna be beef. But I had such a great time. Christmas morning chasing rabbits. Dogs luck. Well, we're gonna have a duck. We've been having a duck on Christmas Day for the last eight years or so. So it's a tradition we cannot break. Hopefully, next year we'll have a duck that lived in our land. So our own, our own duck. That's the plan anyway. So yes, but it has to be a duck. Always has been. And that's how traditions are. You can't break them. So yes. Looking forward to that. Yes. I have the veg left over from yesterday's dinner. So we don't need to cook that separately. Um, it's lots of peas and green beans and that's going to go into the mix with the beef mince and yam. It's going to be healthy too. Very lovely shepherd's pie. We're using a doggy gravy. This is low in salt and sugar, specially formulated for dogs. So hopefully it's going to be a little better for you than usual. Because you have to have gravy with your shepherd's pie. I think I'm one of those people who would say, never mind, never mind our Christmas dinner as long as the dogs have it. <laughs> No, I'm joking. We're going to be cooking ours later, but uh, but theirs need to cook first so it cools in time. Because we can't have hotness. No, we don't like hot stuffs. Yeah, as long as my dogs are happy. Um, Do we tell people about the... We haven't yet. It's not confirmed yet. So I don't oh. want to get people's hopes. No, not yet. But I'll have to find out what it is. Absolutely. Mm.
Oh, someone's gonna be lucky. Little star. Can you show it to someone? Find it. Find it. Yes. Engage your nose. Poked my finger in just to check. Mm -hmm. And it's nice and look. look how lovely that is. That is. Doesn't that just look amazing? Um, extra special treat you But sit. Big puppy eyes. <laughs> right, that's for you. Yes, Merry Christmas. I think they like 